Hello everyone, this is Enjima and I'm very proud to present my TypeSQF editor and this is a little video on how to get started using it. Just a short little, little video where we will download and install the TypeSQF editor. We will create an ARMA3 mission and we will write and execute a simple script in the editor. So um, we start with uh, going to the product website, which is www.typesqf.com. We go to the download section and we press download now. We get a zip archive uh, with a setup file in it. So we run the installer. Just select the options we want. And uh, as a last step, we will just launch TypeScript. So we do that. Then we will start a mission. Uh, so we go into Arma. We go to the editor and select an island. And uh, we will just create a simple empty mission. Let's put one guy in there and we save the mission. Give it the name test mission and make sure to to uncheck this binarize the scenario file checkbox because uh, the type SQF editor will be able to write to read the, the global variables that you put into the, the mission uh, in the Arma 3D editor uh, unless you binarize the scenario file. So leave that unchecked. And in the type SQF editor, we click File and New Project. And we go to the test mission that we created right now. And we select the mission.sqm file that was created by the Arma 3 Aiden editor. And we select Open. Um, if we save all files now, then we will have in the ARMA3 file uh, mission folder we have now created the test mission.tproy file that is the project file for TypeSCF and that basically contains information about all files that we, we put into our project and the files in the project may be all files in the mission or some of them uh, okay we add a file, init.sqf, and if you're new to scripting, you should know that this init.sqf file is executed by ARMA3 when the mission starts. So here we will write our very simple script. So we declare a variable called number, and we give it a, an initial value of 10, and then every second we will count up this number uh, 1 and show the result in the upper right corner of the screen and we do this with uh, in while loop while well let's say while number is less than or equal to 20 we hint str num so hint is to show it, show something in the upper right hand corner of the screen and str is to convert this number variable to a string that is necessary for the, for the hint. And we will sleep one second each time. Except for this, we will also need to count, count the number up, number equals number plus one so we show the number on screen we increase it by one and we sleep one second and then we start over again 
until number equals 20. In ARMA 3 then, we play the mission and in the upper right hand side of the screen we can see the script running counting up from 10 to 20 and when we're at 20 it will stop and exit the script okay thanks for watching